Yeah, so if you want to make a real estate logo in Canva, uh, just search for one. Search for a template. Uh, yeah, and then just uh, if you run a free account, you can filter the free templates. Click apply. Uh, find a logo you like. Uh, let's just take this one. Click on customize. Then just add your own name. I don't know. My name, my name. So company. My company. I I just let's just call it company because you, I mean you would have to resize the text and font size right here, but I just don't have. The, yeah, that yeah. So uh, if you want to make adjustment to the color uh, and stuff like that, you can always do that right here. You can add custom colors. You can I don't know maybe upload your own brand colors if you have any. Uh, but yeah. So anyway, and once you're done, all you have to do uh, just go to share, download PNG. Or if you have a pro account, you would go with SVG because they're vector files, so uh, they're scalable basically. Uh, what that means there, no matter how much you want to resize them, they will always stay sharp. They will never get pixelated and stuff like that. So, um, like I said, if you have a pro account, I would just go with SVGs for the logos because they're just better for web and like for print and for for anything you want. Basically, they're like I said, they never get pixelated, no matter how much you resize them. Uh, yeah, but also if you're on a free account, if you want to print them, just go with PDF print. But I would just go with PNG if you want to use it like online and stuff like that. Um, yeah, and just check the, the transparent background. Uh, it's only a little bit available for the uh, the pro accounts, basically. So if you don't have one, unfortunately, you're not able to remove the background. So you're stuck with this rectangle, basically. You can use online services like like websites like these to remove the background once you download it. But uh, it's it's okay, but it won't be perfect. It doesn't crop it that well. But it's, if you use it like in small resolutions and you resize it to be like really small, it probably won't be noticeable. So uh, yeah, but basically that's that's how you make a real estate logo. Just find a template you like and then just add your own name and company name, make your own edit, change the color and stuff like that and uh, uh, download the thing. Uh, I mean, there's, there's a decent amount of uh, real estate templates you can use for logos. I'm sure you will be able to find one that looks like you want it to be, so, uh, yeah.